Tonight at 10, this Mayport sailor charged with murder after a child he was babysitting died. 27-year-old Pete Lanty is locked up in the Nassau County Jail tonight. And investigators say the child died last year, but the boy's autopsy results were just released. News 4 Jacks reporter Renee Beninati has been looking into this investigation. She's joining us now outside the Nassau County Jail. Renee, what can you tell us about why he was just now arrested? Mary, in that autopsy report that we just got, the medical examiner found that the boy died from blunt force trauma to his head and then classified the boy's death as a homicide. This arrest report shedding light on the allegations made against 27-year-old Keith Lanty. Deputies say he was babysitting two children in Nassau County in June 2021. When he called 911, saying one of them had suffered a medical emergency. The report states the boy was taken here to the Wolfson Children's Hospital and just two days later was pronounced dead. Investigators talked to the person Lanty was babysitting for, whose name was redacted from the report. Deputies also questioned Lanty, who then walked them through his chain of events. The report says Lanty yelled at the child for vomiting. What happened next was redacted from the report. The document goes on to say Lanty brought the child to the living room to do CPR until help arrived. The report says a child abuse pediatrician found discrepancies between his story and the child's injuries, saying the victim, quote, was too young and incapable of inflicting these injuries upon himself. Doctors added there was no medical history to explain their findings. This Monday, the medical examiner released the results of the boy's autopsy that revealed he died of blunt force trauma to the head. The next day, Lanty was arrested at an address linked to Naval Station Mayport, where command confirmed with News 4 Jacks, Lanty works. Once again tonight, Lanty is being held here at the Nassau County Jail without bond. We went by his home on the north side. We'll share what his neighbors had to say about his arrest coming up tonight at 11. Reporting live in Nassau County, Renee Beninati, Channel 4, the local station.